um, it's been a while since I filmed a video. Um, that's because I've been a little bit quieter, I had a little bit of a break on social media and basically just the internet. I have been sharing things uh, of like why and things like that online and there will be also a blog post I think sometimes sometimes next week so please check that out if you want. I don't know what I'm doing. I am sitting on the floor like a true hippie today feeling the floor vibes today feeling the grounding vibes today but yeah what I wanted to talk to you guys about today is loving yourself for who you are loving your body for just the way it is so it's something that I've been struggling with for a few years and I to this day struggle with it to this day I I work on it I need to work on it and it's like a constant journey constant process and constant learning basically um i've gone through it all pretty much i've gone through under eating and abusing myself with food to binging and overeating healthy foods like just eating super healthy i've tried it all to find a balance um i exercised like a lot my body physique like two years ago was perfection in my eyes was perfection that doesn't exist though perfection but in my eyes um but mentally i was so poorly like I, I wasn't good so i want to talk about what i do now with like learning the great techniques and like diving deeper into spirituality and everything of what i do to just help myself feel better and to just love myself because number one person that needs to love you first is you literally is you how can anyone else like how can you love anyone else if you don't love yourself do you know what i mean do you know what i mean <laughs> so basically yes we need to love ourselves um so definitely what i love to do is meditate and that's for any aspect of our life we can literally like apply that to any issue in our life or somewhere that we're struggling or someone that just we feel uncomfortable with meditation is great for everything for zoning out for de-stressing for issues with um like confidence or body image anything so i like to do at least five minutes a day of meditation which is really not a lot it really doesn't take much time of a day whether you do it in the morning in the evening or during work time or even you can do it when you go for a walk a little bit of mindful walking and meditating all it takes i like to burn some incense because i feel like incense sticks and like the smells really calm me really make me feel grounded and just connect me to like a higher self and like put the everyday life to halt for a bit so i feel like um incense is a definite must and i personally like to use crystals as well but that obviously isn't a must um it's just a helpful factor for me because i connect with crystals a lot like I love crystals if you don't know already um so I just meditate basically my meditations look different every time pretty much um sometimes I'll sit there and just uh focus on my breath just taking my breath in and out and different forms of breathing and that in itself makes you not think about anything around you which like kind of frees you of any negative thoughts or self-doubt which is already a plus I also like to go to my happy place which is my favorite form of meditation i love to go to my happy place and connect with like a place that i feel safe and comfortable with the most like i just feel like that place i am my best version i'm my happiest self i'm where i'm supposed to be and i start to like see myself as a happy human knowing that i can be like this in this world too basically so it's like law of attraction a bit as well isn't it you see yourself like that you know you can have it so my happy place is my favorite form of meditation and sometimes it's just having a conversation with myself i know that sounds weird and you might think whoa girl you're being weird but no i just talk to myself literally i'll sit down at my altar with my crystals with my candles with my incense and i'll just have a conversation with myself saying like yeah 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 it's good you're good you're looking good you're fine everything like that like talking about my day talking about how I'm feeling like really deep down what's bothering me just letting it out laying all my emotions out like to the deepest part of my emotion like dig deep and I let that out like so if I'm feeling crappy about my body today I'll admit it sometimes I think I'm not whereas deep down I am I'll admit it I'll let it out 
and truly dig deep why I'm feeling like that but why am I feeling like that but why am I feeling like that and then I really like find the true meaning of why I'm feeling the way I'm feeling by just talking to myself I mean that's pretty simple another thing that um apart from meditation that I've been doing um is mirror work and that's something that I've only been doing quite recently and it's probably the best technique ever like it's such a fabulous technique and if you struggle with like image issues this one is for you or any self-confidence issue really but this one's for you because it's very very visual so if you've never done this it may be a little bit weird it may feel a little bit weird you may think you're going nuts um but all is good because you will feel amazing and you will love this method basically so just find a mirror i use this mirror behind me um and just sit down whether it's in the morning where i've got like make a little bit of makeup on i'm ready for the day or whether it's in the evening where i'm looking all cozy in my pjs or whatever it doesn't matter like now i know it doesn't matter so i just sit in front of the mirror i look at myself i'm like hey <laughs> hi um no i just say hi you're looking pretty i'm pretty yeah and i talk to myself with it with myself like literally visually i talk to myself out loud because i find that that works best for me but not shouting because there's people in the house so i don't want them to think i'm creepy um but yeah just talk to myself saying i'm confident i'm good at what i do i'm great at work i look really really pretty and i mentioned like if i see features that i really enjoy in myself i'm like oh my lips look really nice today and my hair's really working for me today you are great now you're amazing blah 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 whatever you need to say that works for you so you could be like you're amazing your life is fulfilled you're doing great at work you're so talented so beautiful you're a beautiful figure look at you you just look really great mate look at you you look fantastic have a little banter with yourself you know put a lot of fun spins on it you know don't just be boring so i'm just like no you know what you look fabulous today darling and i'll just you know do these little funny things like that and that one is my favorite kind of like self-love for my body image work mm, i also like to write on my bathroom mirror with lipstick the old-fashioned way with lipstick hey beautiful in red lipstick in the corner of my mirror and every time i go there i'm like hey beautiful oh hey beautiful that's me uh, i know that like for some people my sign can't be vain and cocky whatever it is not because we need to love ourselves there's absolutely nothing with loving ourselves it's been written into us from a very very young old stage that loving yourself is wrong and that it's vain and that it's cocky or whatnot it is not the point that is not the case you can love yourself you must love yourself basically it is the best feeling of loving yourself because if you love yourself you feel so much more confidence in yourself in every aspect of your life not just the physical but every aspect of your life but yeah I will write that on my mirror saying, you can do that with any mirror, it doesn't have to be a bathroom mirror by the way. But I write that on my bathroom mirror, hey beautiful, or you're looking gorgeous today, whatever you want. Something that will uplift you, you know, whatever. And every time you go there you'll see and be like, you're just a little smile. Do you know what I mean? So that's one of the little things that I also do. Um, sometimes I'll just lay down flat on the floor and just talk to myself again, but more in more in um, like mantras and affirmations. So I'll just say out loud all the things I'm like I am. So I am beautiful, I'm kind, I'm worthy, I'm talented and just say those out loud or in my mind, laying flat on the floor. It makes a difference laying flat on the floor. I'm not sure why. Maybe it's to do with the whole grounding. You're really grounding your body to the ground, literally. Um, and it just feels kind of different. You feel like you're giving it out up to the universe. So you know I find that that's different and reading books reading books is really good for you finding books that are self-help books and aimed at whatever area of your life you feel really unconfident and unloved with that's a good one I've been through a lot of books um literally I wouldn't be able to name them all because there's just been so many but there is just so 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 many fabulous books if you just go on Amazon you'll find loads and YouTube there's loads of amazing YouTubers out there and like spiritual teachers or anyone that can just really put you on an amazing track by you just following them and seeing what amazing things they have to share 
totally um and the last thing for today there is usually more i have written a blog post on like loving yourself and treating yourself and things like that but last thing for today is the weirdest one that i've recently done and it felt so so weird but oh my god so nice at the same time it is a really weird one for me like that was the first time i've done it. i've seen it in movies and i always laugh um but it is worth doing so basically i don't know where i read it but i think i was in my oracle cards it told me to hug myself so just give myself a hug and i was like okay so i did i gave myself a hug you know the usual and not just sitting there and tap each other you really have to feel like you are giving yourself a hug like you know you're feeling your hands around you feeling like i love you now like i love you for who you are the way you are you and me together for everything i love you and hug yourself like proper hug yourself and feel yourself being hugged you can close your eyes if you want and see how you feel for me it was a really strange feeling like i'm hugging myself but i actually felt really emotional i started crying because i was like i was approving of myself nat was approving of nat it's a really weird like dimension and feeling but it is the real deal and it works and i have done it i can confirm i did feel weird at first and i thought maybe i'm being crazy now maybe we're going to the dimension of craziness but no it is really good for you and it's such a simple little act of love you can literally do it anyway you can just be at work and be like no one's looking and just hug yourself literally just hug yourself pat yourself you've done a good job you're doing well you're gorgeous you're amazing love you love you love you and don't worry about what anyone else is thinking like don't worry what others may think if they saw it or if you told them that doesn't matter it's how you feel with yourself that matters you and you and you we have to put ourselves first sometimes we have to in order to help others and be nice around others basically it's that simple so have a go at all these little um tips i have i have more on my blog post if you just go onto my website which i will link down below go check that one out and um let me know if you do any of these if they helped you i'm sure they will they do help um which one's your favorite um and how it made you feel i love i love i love to know basically i love hearing people's experiences and how they feel etc so yeah these are my quick short tips there is way more work there is some you can really really get into and you can read on my blog like i said and you can go online everything like that you can there's a lot of self-love work but we all need to be doing it if we're feeling really unloved by ourselves that's a must that's homework you need to do it that's homework but yes um thank you for watching i hope you enjoy this video um in my hippie position on the floor being a true hippie and spiritual being that i am thank you for watching um and yeah I'll see you again soon, hopefully.